Hello Scorpio, welcome to the reading. Let's see what we have for you today. What message does the angels, spirits and guides have for the sign of Scorpio at this time? Messages to the angels and guides are for the sign of Scorpio at this time. Here we go, justice. This is all about karma. And there could be some legal issues, whatever it is you're involved with. But I feel whatever decisions you've made in the past, I've put you where you are now, and the decisions you are making there will be consequences either good or bad but I often there's a connection here I feel that you or the person you're dealing with is in now often justice I'm picking up for some of you divorce or the person you're dealing with is in a divorce Mm, page of Wands, New Direction. Somebody here wants to go in a new direction. Mm, been preparing the approach as well. You're concerned with a connection that is not where you're at. It's at, it's at a distance. It's somewhere else. Mm, the split loyalties here is a test of commitment. But this is loyalties to yourself as well. It's fraught with challenges. But I'm picking up some determination here. For a wand, change of location. For some of you, it's relocation permanently. There's a decision here. It's an emotional decision. Mm. You're quite disappointed on how things are working out. Progress is very, very slow. You, you are turning your back on a connection either that you're in. You're losing interest. This is either a connection you're in or a connection that wants to come in. Either way, you're moving on. Six of Swords, you're moving into positivity. And again, I'm picking up travel. Moving on. Let's see, Justice. Yeah, there's a decision here. This, for a lot of you, this is all about karma. Truth. Realising the truth, speaking the truth, hearing the truth. But... That truth and that decision is a double-edged sword. You know, make make sure the com the communication is clear and it's and it is really, you know, you're of a clear mind of it, exactly what you want. The world card, yeah, the connection could well be at a distance. That's quite challenging. I'm picking up a lot of movements here. Travel, distance, emperor. Yeah, could be an Aries you're dealing with. Somebody who's in full control. There could be control issues here. The decision is, do you want to go for this or do you want to walk away? Mm. There's an offer here. Somebody's got something to say to you. Possibly somebody from the past. Hmm. An ending. Whatever you decide to do, there's going to be an ending for you. And also coming out of a very, very bad cycle. It's kind of all change. You... You're definitely turning your back on something now. Feeling stuck. Hmm. Could be that somebody's stuck on you or you're stuck on them, you know, emotionally. Oh, excuse me. Two cards dropped. 
I'm going to put them back as I'll keep shuffling, but ten of wands again and ending of a, a burdensome cycle, becoming much more focused. And the moon card, there's also, you know, it's a time for being very, very intuitive because it's kind of like walking into unknown territory. So what this four of wands is all about. Yeah. You're being very cautious. But there's some there's, there's challenges there. There's determination to see this through for some of you. Your struggles are nearly over. Yeah, decision on who you want to be with and where you want to be. King of Pentacles. You know, if if you are relocating, selling your house or whatever, I feel you'll be dealing with an estate agent or a landlord. Three of Cups, yeah. Coming into a much happier cycle, reuniting with somebody. I'm picking up different cultures. Mm. But either way, you're coming into a much happier cycle. I feel with the justice card there as well, you, you're going to make peace with your past. You're going to close the door on it and move on either way. But there's a decision here on relocation. For some of you, you'll be already in a connection and want to move elsewhere. For some of you, there is a divorce. But there's a strong, strong pull of travel here relocation and reuniting with somebody but it's like a win-win outcome for you it's it's like you know the path this this has happened and it's forced you into another path and it's forced it's putting you in a much happier cycle much more joyous and much more celebrations but you know, you've got two tens here. And there was a card earlier, ten of ones. It's it's all change. There's definitely a bad cycle ending and a much more stable cycle coming in. Thank you very much for watching. Bye bye for now.